A new bombshell report from the Washington Post revealing more of what was found during the search of Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago estate. Now, CBS 4's Nicole Lauren joins us live now from the FBI office in Miramar. And Nicole, what info did the agents find here? Yeah, hey there, Keith Maribel. Good morning. Well, the Washington Post breaking this story detailing that in Trump's Mar-a-Lago estate, the FBI seized so many classified documents, including some of those documents detailing a foreign country's military defenses, specifically their nuclear capabilities. The Post, though, did not name that country. Now, obviously, this did sound a lot of alarms for U.S. intelligence officials, and that's why it was a cause for concern because of those top secret U.S. operations detail. Now, only the president, some members of his cabinet, or near cabinet level would have clearance to authorize other government officials to know details of these special access programs. Now, in an interview with Anderson Cooper, Devin Barrett with The Post details the type of information that was found and how confidential it really is. I think, I, you know, I think it's it's such a sensitive area that, you know, there's there's categories and subcategories of that kind of information. Some of it is essentially Department of Defense information uh, that falls under the classified system umbrella. And obviously, when you talk about special access programs, when you talk about nuclear capabilities of foreign military uh, agencies, uh, those are things that the government, the U.S. government, in no way wants um, spread around. Now, the Post did request a comment from Trump's legal team, but they never heard back. We're live in Miramar. Nicole Lawrence, CBS4 This Morning.